Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do an update for the Roulette Pan collab. This is a collab or project created by Rebecca and Alexandra and I will have them listed down below as always. So we are doing the fifth round of the Roulette Pan collab and for the second round Alexi and Rebecca opened it up for everybody. So I'm finally doing this project. <laughs> so. This is the second update and I don't have a new product to show you guys or rotate out or anything so I'm just going to talk about my products and where I, where I am and so on. So this might be a boring video. You decide that. <laughs> the first product I want to talk about is the W7 Lip Tripper Holographic Lip Gloss. I have used this in total. Eight times I have it on my lips right now because I didn't have anything on after work so this is a, a nice lip gloss I really really like it I don't wear it often as you can see I have worn it eight times in the past two months but I am really excited to be using it here and there it's insanely beautiful and just a really really nice gloss it's not sticky or anything so it's really comfortable on the lips. My goal for this is to use it 20 times and I really need to step up my game if I want to hit that goal. And that was a unique product. For the something from a lesser known brand, I have the Trended Up Metallic Cadell Eyeliner. It is this bronzy, metallic -y, metallic -y. It's a covery eyeliner. And I have used this five times in total. I just forget to use it because I really like to use it underneath my eyes and I just forget in the morning time. So hopefully I can hit the 20 uses mark. I would like that. Then we have a product that I regret buying. I regret buying this very dark single eyeshadow from Kiko. It is the shade 133. It's a beautiful maroony brown shade. I really like it for my outer corner. It's a little bit too cool tone for me if I want to do this orangey eye look. <laughs> but I have used this in total 11 times. So my goal is to roll this out next update. Then we have a product with cute packaging and I chose the W7 Casino, pa Casino palette. It is a blush, highlight and contour palette. And it is looking like this and I was torn with what shade I wanted to focus on between the orangey blush and the highlighter. I chose the blush and the goal is to use up the the pattern, you know. Hopefully you can see that it isn't that opaque anymore. You can still see it, but it is definitely going down. So I'm really, really excited about the progress and I adore this palette. It is so beautiful. I wouldn't consider this as a contour, more like a dark blush. It's so beautiful and it shimmeries and it looks really nice on the skin. Then we have this one. This is the W7 Princess Potion Complexion Booster and Primer. I try to use this as a primer in the morning time before my makeup, of course. And I used that four times and then I realized I didn't like it because it made my skin more oily and my matte foundation oily and greasy and it, it started to cake up on me and I wanted to use it as a nighttime serum and I've used that a few times and as a night cream. That is what I'm going to use this for because I don't like it as a primer. It's still here and I've used it like seven times in total. And the last item I want to show you guys or talk about because we have six items in total in this project and it is the Estee Lauder lipstick in or pure color lipstick in pink berry. This is a product that is special to me and I got this from my grand cousin or cousin from Texas. She insisted of buying it to me. Can you say that? She insisted. I, I need to have it and she wanted to pay even though I said no. So this is very, very special to me. I have used this in total seven times since the last update, which is really, really good actually. So this is my cool toned lip color. I really, really like this lipstick. It is beautiful and the packaging is really nice. So I adore this. So my goal is to roll this out by next update as well. Then I am done with this update. It's really, really boring because I don't need to roll another one in, but I think I have made some progress, you know, use 
using time but that is what i wanted to do for this project i really want to use some products that i didn't necessarily have to finish nonetheless i hope you enjoyed and until my next video please take care and check out the other ladies down below